This video will demonstrate how you can assign multiple tasks at one time in ServiceNow. First, you want to click on the All menu option. This will bring up the Filter Navigator. Next, you want to search for Tasks. And then you want to click on the Task menu option under the Service Catalog. This will display a list of tasks. Now, the first approach to updating multiple tasks is from the List view. Now, the first thing that you'll want to do is place your cursor on top of the field that you would like to update for multiple tasks. Now, in this case, I will update the assignment group field for several of these records. And what you want to do is you actually want to press control down on your keyboard and you want to click into these fields here. So you can see as I click on the field, it has the purple box displayed around it. Now you want to go ahead and you want to select all of the different records that you would like to update. And again, I am holding down the control button. Next, what you want to do is double click into one of these fields. Now you can see here, this is going to bring up the quick edit menu and you can see that it is displaying the text. The number of rows that you selected will be updated. Now I will go ahead and select my assignment group here. Now you can see here I've selected the software assignment group and next you want to click on the save icon. And you can see here I was able to set the assignment group to software for multiple tasks. Now I will repeat the steps for the assigned to field to actually assign these tasks to an individual. So again, you want to hold down control and you want to click on the fields for all of the records that you would like to update and you should see them changing color. And then again, you want to double click into any one of these fields. And then you want to go ahead and select the value that you would like to update these records to. In this case, I'm going to assign these records to an individual. Now you can see here, I am assigning these tasks to Fred Luddy and I will go ahead and click the save button. And you can see here that those tasks have been assigned. Now, if you're finding this video helpful, then you might also be interested in one of these ServiceNow tutorials. I've included links to these videos and my how to use ServiceNow playlist in the description of this video below. Be sure to check it out after you finish watching this video. All right, now the second approach that I'll demonstrate can be used to assign multiple tasks to an individual and to update other fields on those tasks at the same time. Now for this approach, again, you want to navigate to your list of tasks and you want to go ahead and check the boxes next to the tasks that you would like to update. Next, you want to place your cursor on top of one of the column headers and you want to right click and then you want to select this option that says Update Selected. Now, in most cases, you will need to have elevated permissions in order to be able to update multiple records. If you don't have the ability to do this, then check in with your ServiceNow admin. And you can see here that this is going to display the catalog task form with all of the different fields empty. Next, you want to populate the fields that you would like to update with the desired values. Now you can see here that I've updated several fields, including the assigned to field, the approval field, priority, state, and I've also added a comment in the work notes field. And again, once we commit this change, this comment will be appended to the work notes field for all of the tasks that we are updating. Once you're ready to commit this change, you want to click on the update button. Now, if you're finding this video helpful, you may also want to subscribe to my monthly ServiceNow newsletter. In that newsletter, I send around the latest ServiceNow features, content, tips and tricks, resources, and more. You can sign up by clicking the link in the description of this video below or by clicking that card in the upper right-hand corner of your screen. And you can see here the fields have been updated. You can see the assigned to field is set to Fred Luddy, and I will go ahead and click into one of these tasks. And you can see here that the comment was also added to the work notes field. Now, if you found this video helpful, you may want to check out my how to use ServiceNow playlist. That playlist features over 25 other ServiceNow tutorials. I've included a link to that playlist in the description below. See you in the next video.